Welcome everyone to SDN Tech Forum. In this video, we are going to see how to upgrade uh, Cisco Embedded Wireless. In this case, this is C9800 cloud version. I'm going to show you how to do a software upgrade for that. So log into the device. You can see Cisco Catalyst 98. 9800CL wireless controller and this is the version I'm running 16.10.1 in other videos I have shown you how to um, configure and uh, uh, do the policy administration in this video we are going to see how to do a software upgrade for that we're going to go to administration software upgrade so this is a cloud version that's uh, it actually can take some time a little bit of uh, processing time but if you are having if you roll out a powerful machine according to specs it will be quite faster in my case uh, it doesn't have that much of like sufficient memory all right so you can see that uh, the device mode is installed transport mode I'm going to say desktop HTTPS because it's a uh, located the new software is located in my uh, laptop file system there is only one uh, uh, space which is the boot flash of the device the embedded wireless device and let's pick up it from my download download and inst install okay let me free up some space here Okay, so welcome uh, again. I paused the video because my boot flash had some, some issues and everything was full. So I deleted some uh, files manually and now you can see that I have 34, uh, 3, 346 MB of uh, free storage. I don't think it's going to be sufficient for our file because that is somewhere that I have to free up some more space. Okay, now let's try to upload this. You're going to upload this. I'm going to say yes. And you can see the upload bar progresses. So if you uh, browse to other tabs at this point of time, actually this is going to abort the up, uh, up, upload. So stay on the page and uh, while the upload is finished. Also, I want to show you since this is 16.10 version, I don't have the file manager uh, available under management. Once we upload it to 16.11, you should probably see the file manager tab uh, just just so that you can browse the boot flash or any USB. If you attach any USB, you can browse it from here. So this is a little bit of older version. I just installed that for the sake of like uh, showing you upgrade, how you can upgrade to the next model. So upgrade it 100%. Now I'll say install image and packages. The second task. So I paused the video while it was doing the install. At, at this point of time, you can better go to the console and watch the install. So you can see that I got completed install one shot package. So that that means everything is installed. And now you can do a save configuration and reload. Yes. So the device rebooted. Now try to log in again. And perfect. You can see the new software is 16.11.1c. Let's go to administration and you can see that new feature file manager is also available which is actually you can browse your boot flash and any usb if you have you can browse and upload data uh, upload any software directly from here so you can see that my boot flash is clogged uh, because of some internal bug but uh, that just this instance so thank you very much this is what i wanted to show you thank you